here we are at the Harvest Host. And this time it's a winery. And this guy owns all this land. So we're by Galveston Bay. Anahawk, Texas, I think it's called. And we're boondocking tonight, but we told him we'd stay. It's $15 to have hookups. But they were all booked up tonight. So we're just in this field, and it's fine. And he parked us here with a view just looking out at the water. Sun's about ready to go down here pretty soon. And this will work out great for the night. And then tomorrow, we're gonna move right over here to one of these sites. It's got like a canal or a bayou or something going up behind it. Um, and there's water and electric, 50 amp. Yeah. So we just met the guy that lives over here in this Class A motorhome on the, looking right out at the water. Are they, are they smoking? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, it is. Fancy. He's got a nice view too, isn't he? Take that street. Let me check that out. It's quiet out here. The guy said there's, was there 300 places with power? What did he say? You're 30 miles to a traffic light? Yeah. out of Lake Grove Bay. There's an empty lot. Looks like there was a house there. This whole area got wiped out. What year did you say? 08? So these houses all have to be built up too. Well, it gives you a, like a big garage underneath your house. Kind of what we did, except taller and enclosed. <laughs> There's a trailer all built up. This whole part of the country, pretty much houses are built up like this. Anywhere yeah. near the water, yeah. it looks like a double wide built up like that. Yeah, there's a single wide. Maybe that's the bar. No, that's there's two places. It's called... Because uh, I just yeah. looked at that restaurant. I looked at the menu. That one? Yeah. That's that's the bar. I thought he said there was a restaurant up here and there was a restaurant and bar down here. Okay. We'll ask when we go to get checked into the Harvest House which one they recommend. But they make alligator egg rolls. This is the alligator capital of Texas right here. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Those two are enjoying three places just about and then that one's right on the ground wow it's a different way of life around here well this is where we're supposed to stop so you don't go too far the guy asks you to stop it's in your own best interest to stop there's the winery parking over here so he has people parked over here too How many lots did he say you own? So we wanted to show you this place over in the bay here. We went from where our harvest host is Water. into the town of Anahawk and ran across this place right here. Look at that. It looks like they have their own chapel in there. Texas flag as often as, the as often as the American flag. So this guy had four homes in here and back in 2008, I forget which hurricane it was, wiped everything out. And this must have been one of the locations for one of the homes. 
because you can see where the, they usually build them up with telephone poles. You can see where all those were. So there was uh, at least nine of them here. It looks like that the house was built on. And even though it was raised, like these other places, okay. it's gone. And he was telling us that his house was built by Neil Diamond, built 14 houses for people here that lost their homes. And he even has the wedding chapel over here across from his place. And he owns all this land. So he allows people to do, this girl over here is boondocking. She's traveling around. She's got a toy hauler. She's gonna come over here and use the sewer hookup for dumping station. So this will do just great. There was three campers in here. We were parked over there by that tree. And uh, he said we could have either one of these sites. So we opted for this one, the biggest one. And uh, <laughs> Dixie's loving it out here. <laughs> She's happy to be out of the camper. There's a little canal behind us here. So this is the wedding chapel. As you can see, it's right on this canal. This is all part of the property from the harvest house. Maybe Frescone, Frescone, Winery, Bistro.